Hello Joshua Nation, welcome back to another video, and as you can see, I'm right here, as you guys know, today is Sunday Night Chaos, our pay-per-view chaotic summer is today, but we recorded it, okay, in the original home of Sunday Night Chaos here, as you guys can see, but the thing is, audio work, you can't hear anything in this part of the video, but there is part two, and part two does have sound, so I'm going to do commentary, some sort of commentary for part one. So let's click play and let's do it. There I'm doing the introduction. Hello Joshua Nation. Welcome back to another video. There I am saying that we're cut back to the original home of Sunday Night Chaos. You're doing the intro with my ultimate warrior shirt and my beautiful title as you guys can see there shining so backstage oh lots of fun memories here there was Myra she wanted to see the show so she was there just there watching it there's the meatball coming in <laughs> When I was rewatching this, I'm like, Jason, you're holding the title upside down. And he's like, oh. And here's the thing. Ambrose never showed up. So look who comes out. The Bone Crush. So, you know, since Brandon wasn't here, Dean Ambrose did not show up. We had the Bone Crusher. Come in, have a U.S. title shot. Because, you know, he didn't have anything to do in Chaotic Summer. So we're like, all right, you want to be on the show? We got you on the show, Bone Crusher. So here's the match. Ding, ding, ding. Bone Crusher's easy to take down. Hey, see, sometimes he can put up a good fight. All right, I'm going to pretend I'm like an actual commentator from now on. Oh my god, the meatball just slammed the crusher. Oh, the bone crusher. The bone crusher spine. I really hate that there was an audio though. It just looks so weird. Without audio, that's why I made this commentary video. You know, I needed to take a closer look at this match. So there I am. Next, we will be having the Open Challenge. That I have a world title Open Challenge in there. John Cena almost dying right there. Well, the Bone Crusher. Sorry, I really do mess up because I, I know him as John Cena. But his name's the Bone Crusher, right? And there it is, one, two, three. Meatball taking the victory against John Cena. I mean, the Bone Crusher. Do 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 do. And there I am. Stopping challenge. And from Greenwich, Connecticut, he is the world heavyweight champion, Triple H. There I am. Wearing my Ultimate Warrior shirt. My favorite 90s, 80s wrestler. The trampoline. This trampoline is mostly for something like chaos once when we go over there. There I am giving a speech saying that the best and if everyone want anyone wants a shot at me, Triple H, the best in the world, the world heavyweight champion, come out right now. And look who comes El Chicano. And right here he said fifty one fifty Viva la Raza. He's part of LAX. So El Chicano finally came back. 
looks like he fought the fear that was inside of him and came to fight against me. Here we go. And that, that hurt. I thought my neck was going to break right there and I was really triggered. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe the inner strength that Chicano actually had. A colossus. Right, look, this proves my point. My point that El Chicano comes without warning me. If I knew that El Chicano was going to be in something like chaos, I would have been ready. Okay, here Chicano came in by surprise. I'm going to be here. But look, you know, I still got some good hits. But I still wasn't ready to fight him. I was ready to to fight Usher, Dean Ambrose, people like that. I'm not ready to fight a senior. If he would have warned me, this would have been different. He would have been hitting me like this. And that was the end of part one because I actually had an incoming call. I hope you guys enjoyed. Part two will be coming out a little couple minutes after this one. But if you enjoyed this part, please like, please comment, please subscribe, and God bless. Goodbye.